Hi everyone, this is Mike with uh, Mike Unfiltered. Uh, today I wanted to do a test taste review on two of the heavy hitters in the coffee industry. Sorry, fast food coffee industry. And I got the uh, McDonald's McCafe and also the Burger King BK Joe. As someone that tries to find some quick coffee for a cheap price, by the way, here in Chicago, uh, each of these were exactly one dollar, one twelve after tax. Um, same price, just for a small. I got them black, so it's a uh, it's a fair it's a fair review. Okay. Um, so the first one I'm going to try here is the uh, the Mick Cafe. When I buy my coffee, I like to have a nice sealed cap. So when I do this, I just give it a twirl, and I already got some some leakage there on the side. Uh, when I'm driving, I hate it. It gets into my cup holders. That's a big no, and Starbucks is notorious for that. Uh, here's the BK Joe. I could see it swirling on top here. Nice tight seal. Wow. I did not expect that. Look at that. And this is falling all over the place. Look at that. Come on, McDonald's. Not off to a good start. But for anyone going to work, uh, here in Chicago, we have tons of potholes. Uh, going to work while you're drinking this, you know, you're going to be like, that but then a BK strong wow okay I just actually just went ahead of myself here but let's open these up still nice and hot I went I picked these up they're right next to each other um, when I got them uh, they're a little hot to drink right off the bat. You can see they're still kind of steaming a little bit. But uh, perfect time to drink. All right. So my initial impression, I look at them, they look pretty similar. Um, when I smell the McDonald's and the McCafe, it's got a good aroma. I like it. The BK1 doesn't have that coffee smell that you enjoy in the morning. Uh, for some reason. Yeah, McDonald's uh, McCafe definitely has the coffee aroma, which kind of worries me about the BK uh, Joe because it might be a little too watered down. But we'll do a little taste test here. Now the pros, when they do a taste test, they slurp after they put beans or pour hot water, whatever. Uh, I'm going to try here. It's not strong. Uh, it's got a little bitter taste, but it is black coffee. Uh, not too bad. Easy to drink, kind of smooth going down. Uh, I don't feel or taste any uh, fruity notes or hazelnut or anything like that. Uh, it's just plain old black coffee, which is pretty good. It's so far so good. Uh, let me now let me try the BK. Joe. Definitely a different taste. Uh, let me try this this way. You know, it tastes good. 
Uh, both of them taste pretty good. What I just noticed now is the BK Joe is in a styrofoam uh, cup and the uh, McCafe is in a plastic cup. So I know I'm getting a little behind myself, but here the BK Joe is easier to handle when the coffee is fresh and hot. The uh, Mid Cafe one, a little hot. They have to give me a uh, a napkin to uh, to hold it. But back to the taste testing. Uh, Mid Cafe, it's pretty good. It's pretty smooth again. And the BK Joe. For a dollar twelve, they're both pretty good. Uh, you really can't go wrong with both of them. But if I were to uh, if I were to say which one is better, um, I would actually say the BK Joe is is better. Um, if I had to give a number one to ten. As far as fast food coffee goes, uh, black BK Joe, I give it about an eight. Yeah. Um, McCafe, not too far. I'll give it a, a seven, seven and a half. It's, uh, they're both good, both worth a dollar twelve. So um, there's not much of a difference. The taste could be a little different because the one's in styrofoam, one's in paper. That when the coffees are in these different types of containers, they're gonna definitely taste different. Uh, so that might be the reason why that the BK Joe tastes a little better than the McCafe because in the McCafe I could taste a little bit more of the cup as well. It leaves, the cup itself leaves a little bit more of an aftertaste than the foamier cup um, and also it just it keeps it hotter a little bit longer which is nice I am highly impressed having the BK Joe for actually the first time um, they are trying to step up their breakfast game so we will see in the future about their iced coffees and stuff like that so stay tuned